Hi folks, I'm gonna show you how to learn the recipe to make your own Aurora and go over a few caveats. Aurora can be produced at any pharmaceutical lab crafting bench. You can do this at any level, even right at the start of the game. First, you want to travel to Neon on the planet Voli Alpha. When you first enter the city, you see a guy getting busted by security. That's Nesher. At a quick glance, this little event doesn't even seem noteworthy. You see people getting hassled by security on New Atlantis, and it's just background. But this particular guy is actually the feeder to the quest chain Loose Ends, which is what lets us actually produce the Aurora. Hang out near this guy for a few moments and let the scene play out, then continue on, and you'll get an activity pop-up to speak to Nesher in jail. This quest line isn't too long, and it can be finished in about half an hour if you follow the dialogue and everything, or as quickly as like five to ten minutes if you zip through the conversations and stuff. It's not immediately obvious, but in order to speak to Nesher, you need to activate the locked door in the security office that he's standing behind. Nesher wants you to pick up a package from his sleep crate and deliver it to the liquor store. Go talk to the sleep crate clerk, give her Nesher's password, but don't bother paying the credits to get into the abandoned sleep crate that she mentions. There's nothing in there but TP and a coffee mug. After you get the package, deliver it to Yannick at the liquor store. Choose dialogue options that seem like you're interested in more work, and Yannick will give you a follow-up quest to deal with a guy named Felix Sadler. He's in a warehouse where you get some light combat with low-level street thugs who don't really put up much of a fight. Go talk to Felix, and you can either tell him to skip town, or just attack him and drop him, depending on your playstyle. Wait, what? When you go back to Yannick, he seems to think you've got potential, and he recruits you to replace Nesher to smuggle Aurora out of the Xenofresh factory where it's made. Make sure you learn Performance Enhancement 1 at a research lab so that you know how to craft AMP, and Yannick conveniently has one of these right in his store. Follow the quest markers to the Xenofresh corporate offices and apply for a job as a line chemist. You'll get some questions about qualifications, and it really doesn't matter what you put in, you're going to get the job either way. Then you report to the Xenofresh factory and meet Valentina Gurov, who's dealing with some typically unrealistic upper management bullshit. I can't make something out of nothing. Everything is falling apart down here. And you, you go through the job orientation. You get a clean suit to wear, and she shows you the production line. This is a mini-game where you can actually earn a little extra money or steal some crafting mats. The mini-game here, which is actually part of the quest chain, is just to use the ingredients that come out in the little box to craft an unprocessed Aurora. You don't want to use or keep this. It's garbage. Just deposit it into the bin at the other side of the room. Simple enough, but you might get a message saying that your performance is horrible and you're getting crappy pay as a result. Now, it's not obvious, but if you want the full bonus payout, you need to take only the ingredients you need from the box. Don't just loot the whole thing. Take one chasm bass oil, one benzene, one stimulant, and one hallucinogen. Leave the rest. They're really not worth as much as the credits you get from the bonus, but if you really want to roleplay a thief, you can take them. Anyway, repeat this three times and you're done. After your shift, go talk to Robin in the break room. This was Nesher's inside contact. Follow the conversation and tell her the store is open again, then return back to Yannick at the liquor store. When you get back, you'll find Benjamin Bayou and some guards are confronting Yannick, and a conversation happens where you can negotiate a little bit. I suggest saying that Yannick has a lot of customers. Don't worry, you're almost done. Talk to Yannick again after the encounter with Bayou is over and agree to work another shift. Then, after you go work another shift at the Xenofresh factory and make your three unprocessed Aurora, go talk to Robin in the break room a second time, and she'll tell you about a package drop. Follow the quest marker to pick it up over on the other side of... Madame Sauvage's place. But be careful, since you might get jumped by some gang thugs. They don't always show up, but sometimes they're there. Deliver the package back to Yannick, and you're done! You learn the Aurora crafting recipe and can make it for yourself. You can craft Aurora at any pharmaceutical lab, which is useful since you can make it off-world, including on your ship, before you go do a mission, so you don't have to worry about contraband scans or anything. Now remember, Aurora is illegal, so if you get caught with it, you'll get in a little bit of trouble. Three of the crafting mats are easily farmable from outposts, but the Chasm Bass oil is a little more tricky. 
A bunch of the Vendrazon Neon will sell it in small quantities, you can steal it from the Xenofresh factory assembly line, and you can harvest it directly yourself from Chasm Bass swimming in the water down below Neon City, but there really isn't any way to automate farming it, and the supply is always going to be a little bit of an issue. Still, you can make the Aurora yourself without having to smuggle it out of the city, and none of the ingredients themselves are contraband. The real main use for Aurora is to slow time down before difficult boss fights, or if you want to rush to steal a certain starship that I won't spoil super late in the game, or maybe you just like getting zoned out of your mind. Either way, just remember, if you use too much, you'll actually get addicted and need some medical intervention to recover. As always, thanks for watching.